Well, you have to at least admit, it shows some balls for the director to come out and say, hey, before you guys even see this movie, this is not going to follow any of the source material from the comics. I mean, that takes some big-ass balls, don't it? Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel once again. I am Robert Storms. As always, if you're finding me for the very first time, be sure to go ahead and click that subscribe button because every subscriber and like helps. It helps me out a lot. You know what else helps? When a director is very honest, like Todd Phillips. So Todd Phillips came out in a recent interview. As we know, the Joker's began ready to be released in October. So, you know, there's probably been some questions, some interviews going on with Todd Phillips. And Todd Phillips comes out point blank and says, hey, you know what? We're not following any of the comic book source material. We are writing our own story. He came out and said, we are not looking to the comics for guidance. We are writing a story about a man and how the Joker becomes the Joker. Our version of the Joker and how he becomes the Joker. Many of you guys might think I might be upset by this. I'm actually not. I'm actually on board with this. I'm actually on board with this a lot because I, I seen different interpretations of the Joker, whether it be the killing joke by Alan Moore or Tim Burton's version of how the Joker became the Joker. There, there's been plenty of different versions on how the Joker became the Joker. And the best thing about the Joker is it's a mystery. Every different Joker kind of has his own interpretation of how that Joker became the Joker. And this version, I kind of want to see something I haven't seen before. So if Todd Phillips and Joaquin Phoenix are able to take the character and do something fresh and new that we can't sit there and go, oh, well, this is from Alan Moore's The Joker, then we, we, we get a different experience. So many people, including me, are guilty of going, oh, well, this is obviously going to take, you know, reference from Alan Moore's The Killing Joke. This is going to be the killing joke, just done in the live action. And for Todd Phillips to come out and have the balls to sit there and say, we're doing our own interpretation of the Joker, we're not following anything in the comics, and he even says point blank, I know fans are going to get mad about that. And for him to still stick to his guns, I think that's something special. I think that's something special, and we could get something very unique, very, like, maybe something layered that gives us even more of an insight in the Joker. And with Joaquin Phoenix's performance, let's see what he does. I like Todd Phillips as a director. I like the cast of all, whether it be Zazzy Beats or Joaquin Phoenix or Robert De Niro. I think it's a great cast, great director, and I just want to see what they can do. And I'll be very interested to see what this new story is. I want to see a new interpretation of the Joker and see what they can really bring together on screen. So, anyway, what do you guys think about Todd Phillips? Phillips's comments. Are you happy that they're going away from the comics, not touching the comics at all? Are you happy that they're doing their own thing? Or does that upset you? Be sure to leave your comments in the comment box below. Until next time, as always, I'm Robert Storms, and that's my opinion.